Hello, my day family. How are you doing today? For those of you that are new to my channel, my name is Mayday, and I'm a licensed counselor with a YouTube channel. I like this video for the YouTube algorithm as well. So let's go ahead and get started. The news is popping. So the latest news is that Lizzo recently collaborated with Cardi B on a new song called Boomers, and Lizzo is now trending because she went on live and started crying due to the fact that people are making fun of her they're making fun of her for being fat and they're also calling her a mammy so basically saying that Lizzo makes music to collaborate with white people people she's being accused of making music uh, in order to cater to white people and so a lot of people are calling her a mammy a lot of people are making fun of her for being fat or overweight or whatever the case may be and so she took to live to um express her feelings about that and she was crying very sensitive about it uh and we're gonna take a look at what that video looks like here's one of the comments that she got that says no shade but lizzo is a mammy for the white gays only reason her act is marketed and executed like that. The backlash did start after she posted this particular video with the tights and the short shorts. And so from what I'm seeing, I'm seeing a pattern when it comes to famous people, especially famous artists, specifically rappers and singers and things like that. Every time they drop some music or a new music or a new song, the very next day, there's some drama. So that's weird to me. I'm just saying it's a pattern that I've noticed. Armani and Cardi B dropped together like a day or two days later. There was some drama coming from the artists themselves addressing something negative in order to i don't know what they're trying to do with that it seems to me like just in order to push the song um higher up on the charts right because everyone knows or should know or if you follow me you do know that human behavior dictates that that we tend to focus more on negative comments as human beings it's easier for us to uh hyper focus and catch on to the negatives than it is to the positives because that's how um typically our brains function and so it seems to me the pattern that i'm noticing is that you know these artists will put out a new song and then immediately or shortly after follow with a dramatic story or um you know like this posting right here or something like that in order to get their name trending and, and boost up the song and things like that so I find it hard to believe that Lizzo is just now waking up to the reality that people talk about her and she even says it in her video that it's not new to her and I don't think that her feelings aren't true I actually think that, that her feelings are true but I think that what the main reason for sitting and recording yourself crying about these things 
uh, is probably because it helps with the song, the ratings. But that's just my opinion based on patterns that I've noticed. However, I still think that the way that she feels and the things that she says are real. They're, they're true. Uh, but she's choosing now to, you know, initiate this conversation and to make this video because it does directly tie back to that music video. And those are my thoughts, just kind of based on the way that humans function and what they are most likely to respond to, which is the dramatic, right? So it's typically better if you're going to bring up things that are emotionally intense in nature to tie it back to if you have like a product that just came out or a song that just came out so people can listen, 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 and it goes up in the charts. However, you guys let me know what you think. You guys let me know what you think. I made another video that goes into a little bit more as far as uh, human nature and, and, and how that works. So I will leave the link below. It's a, it's a review video as well. Um, another thing is that, you know, I just find it hard to believe that she's just now waking up to the... Lizzo is just now waking up to the reality of what it means to be in the public eye, you know? From a logical perspective, it, you know, it just makes me wonder on the timing of it all, right? So I do feel for her because these are comments that she gets um, very, very clearly so because they're on public platforms. And I'm sure that at, at times she feels that way, the way that she feels. Like it didn't come off to me like her tears were forced because when you tap into the, those emotions, you don't necessarily have to force the tears. I'm sure that that's a part of her job that, you know, that's how she feels about it. And she chooses now to let us know about that because then her name can kind of go up in the charts and so can the song as well. So you guys let me know what you think. Comment below, hit the like button for the YouTube algorithm and subscribe. Definitely subscribe and consider joining the Mayday family. Love you guys. I will talk to you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.